Why don't chairs ever get stressed out, even when doing gentle chair yoga for seniors PDF? Because they always have the ability to recline, and no matter how old they get, they never crack under PDF, pretty darn flexible. And now, let us explore 11 practical tips on gentle chair yoga for seniors PDF. Tip 1. Create a comfortable space. It's important to find a quiet and comfortable space for practicing chair yoga. This space should ideally have a sturdy chair without arms, so you can move freely, and enough room for the suggested movements. The chair would serve as your primary yoga tool, so it must provide sufficient support. Adequate lighting and a peaceful environment can also enhance your yoga experience. Tip 2. Start with breathing exercises. Before diving into yoga poses, it's beneficial to start with slow, deep breathing exercises. It helps to calm the mind, reduce stress, and prepare the body for physical activity. Breathing deeply and rhythmically also allows you to focus on your body, take stock of how you're feeling, and build a sense of mindfulness that'll stay with you during your practice. Tip three, warm up your body. Just like any other physical activity, it's necessary to warm up your body before starting with yoga poses. Gentle joint rotations, particularly for your neck, shoulders, wrists, and ankles can be very effective. This prepares your body for the movements to come and reduces the risk of injury. Tip four, remember posture alignment. Good posture is essential during chair yoga to maximize benefits and minimize injury risks. Keep your back straight and align your neck with the rest of your spine, ensuring your shoulder blades are relaxed and down. Your feet should be flat upon the floor and knees aligned directly over the ankles. Tip five, do not push yourself too hard. Yoga should be a pain-free experience, gentle on your body. If any pose causes discomfort or pain, stop immediately or modify it. Never push your limits to the point of pain. Chair yoga is meant to provide relaxation and stretch, not to cause distress. Tip six, use props if necessary. Using yoga props like blocks, belts and pillows can increase comfort, correct alignment and make poses more accessible. This holds particularly true for those with limited mobility or pain in certain poses. Always aim for comfort and ease rather than strain. Tip seven, modify poses as needed. Not all traditional yoga poses are feasible when adapted to a chair format. Feel free to modify poses to fit your personal comfort level, flexibility and strength. If you're unable to perform a certain pose, move on to the next or take rest. Always prioritize safety over technique. Tip eight, practice regularly. To get the most benefits from chair yoga, it's important to practice regularly. Start with a few minutes a day and gradually increase your routine as your flexibility and strength improve. Consistency helps you enjoy lasting benefits of yoga, such as improved balance, flexibility, mood, and overall well-being. Tip nine, cool down after every session. Cooling down is as important as warming up. At the end of your yoga session, take a few moments to rest, breathe deeply, and relax your body. This helps to reduce stress, lower heart rate, and allow your muscles to recover. Tip 10, listen to your body chair. Yoga is a kind and gentle practice. If at any point you feel discomfort or pain, stop what you're doing and rest. Pushing through pain won't bring you benefits. Instead, listen to your body. If something doesn't feel right, trust that instinct. Tip 11, seek assistance from a professional. If you're new to yoga or have special health considerations, seek guidance from professionals. A trained yoga instructor can teach you about appropriate techniques, modifications and precautions that should be taken to practice chair yoga safely. They'll ensure you get the maximum possible benefits from your yoga routine.